What's up you guys, Nick here, coming to you from Austin, Texas, and right now we're at the world headquarters for Bear Performance Nutrition. Now the CEO and founder, Nick Bear, is just beyond that door. If by some chance you haven't heard of him, he's a world famous YouTuber, a freaky athlete, the CEO of this company, and we're gonna go play a game of workout horse in his gym. Let's go say hi. Yo, there he is. Yo, yo. What's up? Look at this gym. Dude, the gym is unreal. Oh, thanks, man. Looks so good. We're about to, about to get a little training session in? All right, now Nick and I were running this morning and I was trying to think of a crazy competition for you, my subscribers, and during a stereo chat, I think we figured it out. I think we have an idea. Let me tell you guys what we're doing today. You know, I had the absolute pleasure of joining you and your team this morning. I haven't run intervals since I retired three years ago. It was so much fun this morning, man. Thanks for including me. Yeah, man, I love those Wednesday mornings. That team has been game changing for my success in training and running. I used to run 10 miles a day. I used to do intervals like we did today, you know, two or three times a week. And yet I'm kind of like gasping for air next to you while you're just gliding right along. And it gets me wondering, is there anything that I can beat Nick Bear at? I guess we're about to find out. I was coming up with an idea. I'm like, all right, I wanna, I wanna challenge Nick. I wanna actually find out what I can beat Nick at. And for those of you who have been following me on YouTube, you saw me do something similar with Claire P. Thomas. Uh, she's a famous Instagrammer, and she and I played a game of horse in the gym. So I would select an exercise, and then she would try to attempt that exercise, and I would try to attempt it. Whoever did worse at the event would get an H, right? Then she would select an exercise. So just like playing horse on a basketball court, we went back and forth trying to see who could win at these events until it came down to the final event, which she absolutely smoked me at. It was a hurdles race. But I thought, Nick, what if we went into your beautiful BPN gym, tested out the new equipment, and let's see if I can even give you one letter. What do you say? Let's do it. Here we go. All right, thanks for the chat, man. Guys, I am having so much fun with this app. Click the link in the description below, download it today, and join me on my next episode on Stereo. All right, now you guys know I love it when there's a prize on the line. There has to be something we're fighting for. Okay. Here's what I propose. $1,000 to the charity of the winner's choice. I like it. What's your charity? My charity will be Team RWB. So Team RWB raises money for veterans transitioning out of the military to bring them back together in a community through fitness. Very cool, and I'm choosing back on my feet, which helps homeless people recover from addiction. It builds community through the sport of running. I like it. So two good causes. Well, I got one more for you. This one I'm really excited about. I wear my run gum hat everywhere, and I know you wear your the same one. <laughs> everywhere I go. This lives in my head. Loser has to wear the winner's hat for an entire week. Okay. Let's do this. Let's do it. What's the first exercise? I'll let you pick the first exercise. I'm gonna go with max push-ups, <laughs> last man. <laughs> standing. No! You know I did 300 push-ups a day for 30 days just a couple months back, right? Whoa. He did not see that video, clearly. I'm in trouble still. We're about to find out if that worked. I think I'm still in trouble. All right, let's do this. All right, you guys. Now, Nick and I have a pretty good bet going, but I want to bring you guys in on it. If you can get this video to 1 million views in the first 30 days, I will write a thousand dollar check to one of my subscribers who comments below. Now how you can help get this video to a million views, like, comment, and share with as many people as possible. And when this hits a million views before 30 days, I will pick one subscriber and cut that check. Thanks guys. All right guys, event number one, max push-ups. Little, little thing about this one though, we're doing this to a metronome. Does that make it harder or easier? It's gonna make it harder. I've never done it to metronome. You, you can't rest. <laughs> Here we go, baby. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah! 35. How much longer could you have gone? I could have kept going forever. <laughs> Damn. Oh. All right, man. Let's have army push ups, baby. This is what the military does to you. Okay, I don't feel that bad that the military veteran beat the skinny distance runner. Because we didn't do a whole lot of push ups as distance runners. That's but I'll take the H. 
Damn, I'm off to a bad start. Well, check out the pump I got going. What? You know, I've always been a sit and kicker. It's not about who's winning at the beginning of the race. It's who crosses that finish line first. I will tell you, one of my weaknesses in endurance is I go out way too hard. Yeah, pace. Pacing has always been one of my weaknesses. First, I gotta find something I can beat you in. That probably doesn't involve a ton of upper body. Okay, I had this idea. I think speed and agility may be one place I can get you at. How do you feel about a suitcase carry? Yeah. So here's what I'm thinking. 20 yard down, 20 yard back, 40 yard total. Pick your size. What do you like, greens or reds? 53, 70, Do 70. Dub 70s, down and back. You go first, then I go? Yeah, I think so. Okay. We'll start kind of an athletic stance. Yep. Both feet come down, cross this line, and then the time stops when you cross that line. Okay. I'll time you, you time me. You better have a fast finger. <laughs> Should we get Wyatt over here? An impartial judge? I got it, don't worry. Guys, this is Nick's right-hand man, Wyatt, and he is our official timer today because I don't trust Nick's slow fingers. <laughs> <laughs> Wyatt has my best interest in heart, though. I know, that's another thing. Ready, set. <laughs> slow, slow. <laughs> Weak. <laughs> 10 9. That was soft. I feel good about that. That was soft. I put it out there. Something feels off. Oh, it's I'm wearing a shirt. <laughs> That's what it is. Right, Ready? Let's go, Nick. Set. All the way, all the way. Both feet, both feet. Come on. Ah. <laughs> A good effort though. What was it? 11-7. What the Woo! <laughs> what was that? H to H. Fast. I did find at least one event I can get you in, but it's your pick. Watch him choose deadlift. What's your best deadlift? To date, 700 pounds. Yeah. Not right now. We know that's not my best deadlift. All right, I got one. Okay. Let me test something real quick. <laughs> Oh no. Oh, just static hold? Yep. I hate static holds. <laughs> static holds with 10 pounds in each hand. 10 pounders? Yeah, right here. These plates. Oh man, So okay. what you gotta do, we'll start at the same time. Hold, hold it. out parallel. And as soon as they drop below parallel, you're out. Last man standing wins. All right, you feel good about this one? I feel good. Everything looks square, we, we're good? You like, you like these weights? Yeah, I'm pumped right now. I was gonna do it, punk you a little bit with the five pounders, but oh. then, then I get called out later on. So I'll do I, it, I'll do it. I would've picked up on that. <laughs> I'm sneaky like that. Oh man, I'm integrity, I just trust you. I'm sneaky like that. Hey, I am an Eagle Scout, man. You can trust me. Are you? Yeah. 10 pound plate hold. On you, timer. Get set. Yeah, baby. I feel like my grip's gonna wear out faster than anything. Go to that deep, dark place. Gotta make a minute. <laughs> oh, Go all day. Go one more. <laughs> Too easy. Who's a hoe? <laughs> Use a hoe. Yeah. <laughs> All right, now I gotta really think. I'm gonna, I'm gonna consult my list. I got a couple good ones in here for you. Ryan and I spent about an hour trying to come up with at least two or three we could beat you at. We got suitcase carry. I got a few, I got a few in the bank right now. I'm going double unders. Now, I'm really bad at double unders. But he said he couldn't do a double under. Well. I gotta make sure I can do a double under. First. All right, this may be this may be an easy O for you. All right, for those of you who are unfamiliar, a double under is just like jumping rope, right? So you're very familiar with a single under. Single under, double under is passing the rope twice in a jump. That's not good form, but I can do a double under. All rhythm. It's all speed. Like if the jump shouldn't be like I do it with a little like kip, it should just be all speed on the rope, but I'm not very good at it. I haven't jumped rope in years. I'll set the mark, I'll set the mark. One and done, I think the most I've ever done is 20. 
That's pretty good. I'd be super happy with 20. I know they're not the prettiest, but. It's probably about 19 more than I'm gonna get. <laughs> Visualize it. <laughs> you might actually be able to get me now. Time, baby. That's horrible. Time I was shine. like in my head on that one. I just lobbed a big turd right there. Flush that turd, Nick. I'm about to flush that turd. Here we go, baby. Come on, I need this. The better Nick, the better Nick. Huh? Come on. Yeah! Oh, you got one. You got one. You got an O. No! No! A couple of hoes here in the BP and HQ. All right, after four events, it's HO to HO, and it's your pick. I'm gonna go with the pull up. Max, who can do the most pull ups? Strict or kipping? Strict. Pull up, like chest to bar or chin to bar? Chin over the bar. Chin over the bar. Yep. You're gonna, you're gonna set the mark. Are you sure? I think you should set the mark, yeah. Setting the mark's the hardest part, yeah. It is. So I made the mistake of going first and letting Claire chase me. I think she still would have beat me, but. Here we go. All right, come on, baby. On you. Go on more. One, two. <laughs> Making 10 look easy. Come on, Nick. 12. Come on, all day. 12, baby. 15. Keep going. Too 15. easy. 19. Bam. 20. Nice. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, fight. 21. 21. 21. Oh, come on. 22. 22. Nice work. I thought when you stalled out at 12, I'm like, oh, I can do 12. Uh, I didn't know you were gonna fight so damn hard. Oh man, oh man. 22. 22. You can taste that R. I can. All right, I gotta give it my best. Here we go. Here we go. Some good pull ups right there. 12. <sighs> 14. 15. Seven more. That hurt. That hurt to think there about. There you go. <clears throat> R. H-O-R, baby. Oh, no. BPM leads the way. No. Every day. <laughs> I didn't even get close to you on that. And I actually thought <laughs> when you suggested it because of your size, yeah. I'm like, yeah, I can, I can hang. I can't hang. H-O-R to H-O. Yep. You're running away with it. I gotta go with something kind of like in my wheelhouse. So you ready for this? Yeah. I noticed you have this big open, what do you call this? Loading dock out back. It's, and yeah. it looks like it's almost exactly 100 meters. Okay. 100 meter sprint. Okay. Let's do it. I was actually gonna use that for myself. Oh, that's good. I think, you, you really think you beat me in 100 meters sprint? Hey, I got some tricks up my sleeve. That's <laughs> okay. all I gotta say. Like this. Wow, here we go. We've set it up here in the loading docks, measured it out exactly 100 meters, slightly uphill, slightly upwind, head to head matchup. Now, it would be unfair if I didn't offer you the performance enhancing drugs that I've been using. So you can choose to use it or not, but I'm on it. I'm riding it pretty I'm hard. Back talking He's going now. on natural. <laughs> Save it for your try. Runners ready? I'm not gonna lie. Sit and I, kick. I actually, I actually thought I was about to beat him. And in my mind, I was like, yo, I'm about to beat an Olympian right now. <laughs> so I was like, I'm actually gonna get him. He learned the bison sit and kick trick. I did that, I did that for 12 straight years on people. The only person I couldn't do it to was David Rudisha, because he was so far ahead of me. He's just gone. Dude, I literally was like, holy crap, I'm about to beat him. 
All right, man, H-O-R to H-O-R. It's coming down to the wire, what are you picking? Let me scout my territory in the gym and okay. see, uh, see what my This is where picks, picks get clutch right now, right? All right, what's it gonna be? Next up is going to be- No, he's setting it up. A little weight training. We're gonna do some max bench press. Max bench, not reps, but like weight. Um, you know what, actually, I like where your head's going. Let's do 135 max reps. Damn, okay, lightweight. Yeah. So if he had gone max weight, what's your best? I mean, my best ever is probably like 365. My best ever is like 225, so. But that was 35 pounds ago on okay. too. Well, I, let's, let's just, I'll admit it. Max weight, I can't touch you. So 135, as many reps as you can go. There's some endurance, there's some muscular strength involved. Absolutely, absolutely. Do you want to go first or second? I'll go first. Okay, here we go. Nice, keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. Let me know when you need me. 30. Yeah, keep going, earn it, fight for it. 31, 32, 33, 34, 35. Go five more. Keep going, three, two more, two more, two more. There it is, there it is, 40. Nice. Set that bar high. 40 reps. Watch me just do one and call it and save my strength. <laughs> like, I'm conceding that I'll probably lose it, but in the back of my mind, I'm like, how many could I actually get? Yeah, lightweight. It's lightweight for you. <laughs> this is still pretty heavy for me. Oh, yeah. One, two, three. Yeah, 15. 15. There you go, 16. 16. Come on, 20. Come on. 18. Get the leg get going. Ah. It's serious, baby. <laughs> I go two more. I go one more. I got 21, come on. Go one more. Ah. Oh. There you go. 21. 21. I feel good. I mean, I know I take a letter, but I feel good about that. This is a close tie right here. Well, I got, you got, it's H-O-R to H-O-R-S. Yeah. I got to pick a slam dunk here. You got to, you got to pick a slam dunk and then you have to beat me on one of mine. There's a lot of heavy things in here and he seems to be kicking my ass at the heavy things. But he's got the cardio equipment over here. Quad game may help me out a little bit. What am I talking about? We're going to row, okay? First to 20 cals on the rower. Let's go set it up. All right, so what we've got here is a C2 rower and we can measure our cows here. It's basically like the energy we're putting into the machine. It's not based on our body weight or anything like that. It's how much energy is going into that machine. I'm gonna row until that little number right there hits 20 and we'll see what my time is. If you beat me to 20 cows, I'm a horse and I'll pay up. This is uh, this could be a deal breaker. I said a slam dunk event, but this I don't think this is a slam dunk event for me. I think it's gonna be pretty close. We'll see if it plays out for you. <laughs> Ooh, a risky choice, Cotton. <laughs> Like a hard 200. That's a good effort there. There we go. You beat me at my own event, I'm in trouble. It's game over. There we go, Wyatt. Ready? Everything you got. 20 cals. Blast it. Damn. Come on. He beat me to five. Let's go, let's go, let's go. 10 cows in 16 seconds. You gotta go, you gotta go, you gotta go. Kick. Kick. Come on. Come on, three cows. Let's go. Two cows. Let's go. Oh! Got you by a second. 29. Verified. 29. Instant replay. I got, I got you by it was one 29. second. 29. 
Yeah. That was good though. I liked your technique too. Oh, it's bigger. Just bigger, a slow, strong pull. Bigger strokes, yeah. Yeah, I was like paddling fast. I liked your technique. H-O-R-S to H-O-R-S. However, it's your pick. Wait, how about this? How about this? Because I've lost all your picks. You right? And you've lost all my picks. We agree on the last event. Okay. Deal? How about a uh, dead hang? So I was thinking, if you guys follow this channel, we have this video called hang for 100 seconds, win 100 bucks. Yeah. Strangers literally hang from bars and if they can do it for 100 seconds, I give them $100 I saw, cash. I saw the video, yeah. So this is basically you and me hanging for $1,000. Dead hang. All right. Dead hang, staring at each other. All right, guys, H-O-R-S to H-O-R-S. We've decided together that the last event will be a dead hang. I wonder how your pull-up strength will, will factor into this, because obviously you're better at pull-ups, but my, this is grip strength. My grip strength is pretty good. Really? Yeah, just from years of deadlifting, I think like that, pull-ups. But hey, we'll find out. There's one way to find out. I told out. you, I, I will go until I black out to win this damn thing. All right. Ready, set, hang. Let me know when it's 100 seconds. I want my 100 bucks. Hang here all day. I'm just warming up, man. Might want to call a grub pub or something. Get hungry. I'll be here for a little while. Can I get a time check? I just pull up from here. Oh, can't jump. Dead bug. You come in the BPN house, baby. Pack your bags. Oh man. You guys around. <laughs> Impressive work. Good work, good work. i just glad I hung for four letters, man. I'll pay up $1,000. What's the name again? Team RWB. I'll have to check the minute I get home, but give me my hat. All there right. You go. I'm a man of my word. One week straight, here we go. Rocket, you I wanna, what, though? I wanna see it in photo. <laughs> I wanna see it in video. I want to see it on stereo. I'll say this, it's an easy company to endorse. You have great products and a great it. team. Oh, you guys, you. thanks for watching this video. Make sure you head over to his channel and watch as he trains for his next Ironman. It's awesome, dude. Thanks, man. Good All right, time. see you guys next week. All right, Nick, I'm a man of my word. Here's $1,000 to Team RWB. Check out the memo, Nick Bear for the win. And I absolutely love my new hat. See you guys next week.